Hello everybody and welcome to Yokohama Japan. I am Nathan and how are you guys doing today? Just wanted to give you guys a little vlog on to how we're doing so far on our fourth day of our trip here in Japan. So day one, we were actually supposed to get here on March 1st, but we got here on March 2nd because of flight delays. So we ended up getting bumped up to Delta One, which is a very nice $4,000 upgrade with some very nice leg room. We're able to lay down on the plane. Did rather enjoy it. So we ended up getting to Tokyo Haneda Airport on March 2nd, which was the Thursday. After a very long 14 and a half hour flight from Detroit to Haneda, after we landed, we got through customs and met up with some Japanese friends of ours that actually helped us get our train ticket and they actually got us some presents, so it was very nice to see them. Waking up the morning of March 3rd, which was Friday, we went to our local 7-Eleven to where we got some onigiri and some good snacks to start off our day. We ended up going to the Imperial Palace in the morning, but unfortunately because it was Friday, it was closed. So we ended up walking around for a little bit trying to figure out what we were going to do. So we decided to go see Tokyo Tower, which was about a four mile walk. So after walking for about an hour, we got to go see Tokyo Tower, which was very cool. And after that, we kind of looked up some fun local restaurants to do. And we ended up seeing that there was a Pokemon. What was it, Angel? A Pokemon, a Pokemon Cafe. So we ended up hopping back on the train and heading to the Pokemon Cafe, but unfortunately they only take reservations, so we were not able to eat there. But we did get to go see a cool Pokemon store in Tokyo, so we got some cool gifts for some folks. Then we hopped back on the train to go get lunch from our local 7-Eleven, which was also very good, yet again. After there, we went to the Tokyo National Museum, which was really cool. We got to see some treasures from the Korean history, China's history, and Tokyo's history before wrapping it up and heading back to our Airbnb. So our third day, which was March 4th, which was Saturday, we actually started off with seeing what was local around after we checked out of our Airbnb to do. We saw that there was a local Ghibli shop, so we thought that was kind of cool, so we went to check it out. And then we discovered that there was a gigantic mall that was literally less than a mile away from us. So after we checked out, we headed to a uh, laundromat to quickly dry our laundry that had not dried yet and then we went to this gigantic mall we actually saw a lot of cool stuff at this mall we saw harry potter shop we saw yet another pokemon shop we went to the ghibli store we saw a lot of different cool restaurants and cool things at this mall before we ended up heading out to yokohama after we actually took the train to yokohama it was about an hour long ride and we went through the biggest train terminal that we have gone through yet. So it was a little confusing trying to find our way, but we ended up getting here safe and sound. After we got here, we actually walked and there's a hotel down there that's another intercontinental, which was not our hotel. So they <laughs> pointed us in the right direction and we walked down here and got checked in, parked our bags and went to yet a local, another gigantic shopping center which was actually attached to a fun little like park with some ferris wheel and some different rides kind of a cool amusement park so after we went through and we went up all five floors of this gigantic shopping mall we saw that there was a movie theater they had some american movies playing i mean i wanted to go but it was getting kind of late so we went to get dinner at yet another convenience store we love convenience stores. convenience stores are cheap but yeah, after we got our dinner, we kind of came back and settled in and relaxed. We looked out at the beautiful Yokohama Harbor behind us and we went to bed. So now here we are, day four, March 5th. How did we start our day off? Well, let me tell you, we went to, I'm sure you could guess it, another convenience store yep, where so. we got a nice bento box and Angel here got her pork bun My rolls. daily pork bun. As usual. So. That's our update with our trip so far. We are on day four, March 5th, here in Yokohama, Japan, before we head out to Hiroshima tonight. So, until next time, that's our trip update. Got anything for the crowd, Angel? No, I'm ready to get to Hiroshima. But something that Angel has noticed, that everybody is very fancy dressed here. Yeah, I feel very underdressed. Everyone is dressed so nicely, and they walk everywhere, and there's like a million sets of like stairs. So, I don't know. And these people just be walking in their heels. And there's no trash cans anywhere. So if you have anywhere. trash, make sure that you bring it with you until you find a trash until can. Until you get to the convenience store where they might have a trash can. Yeah. All right. So until next time, good vibes here from Yokohama, Japan.